Praise be to Jesus Christ. I'm in my wilderness shipping container studio, which I haven't made much progress on. I got a tripod and that's about it, but I'll keep poking away at it and keep you guys posted. Um, just want to update you on the latest church drama. This is from a Catholic news agency article dated June 27th. The caption is, Letter from Pope Francis expresses support for Father James Martin's controversial ministry. And so I guess Father James Martin sent Pope Francis a letter and some pictures of his nephew's confirmation. Pope Francis wrote back, I think it was a handwritten letter, um, thanking uh, Father James and affirming his ministry. Pope Francis wrote, among other things, May the Holy Father's warm message encourage and inspire all those in the church who minister to LGBTQ Catholics, and moreover, remind LGBTQ people everywhere in the world of God's closeness, compassion, and tenderness. And I don't have any problem with, you know, the, what the Holy Father is saying here. Um, I know a number of people who work with people who are dealing with um, same-sex attraction, and, and they're doing great work, and they need to be affirmed, and certainly people who you know, have these uh, realities in their life, need to know about the Lord's closeness, compassion, and tenderness. I guess the, the controversy is Father James Martin, uh, a number of times, has said things that contradict the teaching of our Lord Jesus Christ, the teaching of sacred scripture, and the teaching of the church. For example, he tweeted a while ago, he said, interesting, where the Bible mentions same-sex sexual behavior at all, it clearly condemns it. I freely grant that. The issue is precisely whether the biblical judgment is correct. And also in the Catholic News Agency article, it highlights, it says, On May 30th of this year, commenting on the Catholic wedding of British Prime Minister Boris Johnson, Father Martin lamented that same-sex couples could not have access to the sacraments the, the sacrament of marriage. It's very interesting because I celebrated Mass early this morning and the first reading was from Genesis 18. It says, Then the Lord said, How great is the outcry against Sodom and Gomorrah, and how very grave their sin. If you read the New Testament, the New Testament writers, they were pretty clear about what sin is and, and how grave certain sins are. Also, in my little missalette, there's a quote from St. Thomas Aquinas. St. Thomas says, The greatest kindness one can render to any person consists in leading them from error to truth. And so, yes, you know, we need to affirm people who are working with all different types of people. Um, but the issue is, Father James Martin says things that are wrong. And he needs to stop. Viva Cristo Rey.